Are you ready to farm with vegetables? Vegetable farming is rewarding all around the world provided that you have plenty of water on your property and the type of soil which sustains the growth of plants. You should take advantage of the resources at your disposal and bring food from the fields to the market. Agriculture is an important regional driver of rural development, job creation, poverty alleviation, and wealth creation. Good vegetable farmers focus on innovative ways to reconnect the food system with their economies and gain profitable yields in the process. This video is about what makes vegetable farming such a great idea. Let's look at what makes vegetable farming profitable. But before we get into the video, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to the channel with notifications on so you don't miss any of the new videos we post. Farming for Profit There is a world of difference between the typical home garden and a successful market vegetable garden. Organic vegetable farming is a more complex and demanding initiative and requires much more in the way of planning and management than casual home gardening. By the way, if you want to have a serious home garden that provides a significant percentage of your food, the following applies to you as well. Factors to consider To make money from vegetable farming, you have to consider the following factors. Labor costs The home gardener probably doesn't care about how many hours their garden consumes or the paycheck achieved. However, if you're a vegetable farming for profit, labor will be your biggest expense, so you have to think about getting the most return you can for the least effort expended. This is true whether you do the work yourself or hire people to help you. Some crops you will just not be able to grow profitably. You will need to keep good records to determine which suit your conditions. This also means you need to continuously strive to find ways to become more efficient, in example, more output for your inputs, while remaining true to your principles. This can be challenging, because many techniques are scale dependent. Example, double digging garden beds is feasible in the home garden, not so much on a 40,000 square foot market garden. This means that sometimes, growing the size of your garden requires completely changing how you do things and getting new equipment with which to do it. Crop diversity Crop diversity is vital for successful organic vegetable farming. You need to grow an intricate polyculture of crops for a couple of reasons. First, this helps create a mini ecology on your small farm, supporting soil microorganisms and advantageous insects that contribute to garden health. And second, the more different plants you grow, the greater the resilience of your garden becomes. For example, if you're growing just two crops and one fails, you have lost 50% of your profit. On the other hand, if you are growing a complex polyculture of perhaps 30 or 40 crops and three or four fail completely, you are still at 90% productivity. This is important if you are depending on the garden for income or food, management of crop production, and soil fertility. Organic vegetable farming consists mainly of moving manure from where it is to where you want it to be. Vegetable farming for profit depends on maintaining soil fertility by the usage of composted manure, crop rotation, and cover cropping. This has to be incorporated with cash crop production and with your overall garden plan and schedule. For example, carrots don't like manure applied in the same year they are planted. So when planting your crop rotation, you would plant or grow carrots on a spot that was manured the year before before where perhaps onions or lettuces had been grown. Managing Garden Pests Garden pests include animals, insects, weed, and diseases. In the home garden, losing crops to these pests is annoying. If you are vegetable farming for profit, your income can be wiped out completely. In your garden and greenhouses, you must use extensive, passive, and preventative means of pest and disease control. Buy disease-resilient cultivars and you can surround the garden with an electric mesh fence to keep out nuisance animals. Use enough floating row cover each year as a physical barrier against insects and grow multiple varieties of each vegetable and do multiple plantings. Then you should leave large wild strips in the garden to provide habitat for beneficial predatory insects. You should also rotate crops to reduce the buildup of pests. Lastly, you should expend a lot of effort to protect the crops you grow because your income may depend on it. Which vegetables are best suited to make a profit with? We suggest the following 20. Number 1. Amaranth Amaranth's protein content is about 13% or 26 grams per cup, which is much higher than for most other grains. The crop prefers a high elevation. However, you can grow at almost any elevation in temperate climates if it has moist, loose soil with good drainage. Number 2. The Ash Gourd Ash Gourd is also called winter melon or white gourd. The winter melon requires very warm weather to grow. However, you can store it for many months, much like winter squash. Number 3. 
Asparagus You can consider asparagus as a rejuvenating tonic for overall health and vitality. It has numerous fusiform succulent tuberous roots. Furthermore, the plant contains odd little pine needle-like leaves that are uniform, small, and shiny green. Number 4. Baby Corn Baby corn is corn that has been harvested earlier. There are two methods for producing baby corn, either as a primary crop or as a secondary crop in the planting of sweet corn or field corn. Number 5. Beetroot Beetroot is of exceptional nutritional value, especially the greens. They are rich in calcium, iron, and vitamins A and C. Furthermore, the beetroots are an excellent source of folic acid and are a very good source of fiber, manganese, and potassium. Number 6. Bitter Gourd Bitter Gourd is also known as the bitter lemon. It is the edible part of the plant Momordica charantia, which is a vine of the cucurbitaceae family. This is one of the most bitter vegetables among all fruits and vegetables. Number 6. 7. Bottle Gourd Another regional name of the bottle gourd is Lauki. Other than consumption as a vegetable, bottle gourd has several more applications. Number 8. Brinjal The other name of brinjal is eggplant. They are the widely used vegetables in cooking. Commercial brinjal farming is very profitable even with a small piece of land. Number 9. Broccoli Broccoli is one of the healthiest vegetables in the world. Broccoli is a member of the cabbage family and is closely related to cauliflower. Its cultivation originated in Italy. Number 10. The Button Mushroom Button mushroom is the most popular mushroom variety for human consumption throughout the world. In some countries, its production earlier was limited to winter season, but with technology development, you can grow almost throughout the year in small, medium, and large farms, adopting different levels of technology. Number 11. Cabbage It is commonly cultivated in a cool, moist climate. It is a winter crop. You can grow it in the plains. It is grown in varied types of soils, ranging from sandy loam to clay. It requires a pH ranging of 5.5 to 6.5 for higher production. Number 12. Capsicum Color capsicum farming is a very lucrative business. Some varieties are very vigorous and plants can become as tall as 3.5 meters and they produce about 4 to 5 kilograms of fruit on one plant in their life cycle. Number 13. Carrot Carrot is a very popular root vegetable. They are easy to grow in sandy soil. They can resist most pets and diseases and are a good late season crop that can tolerate frost. Number 14. Cauliflower Cauliflower is one of the most important winter vegetables in the world. Good management means you can produce up to 0.256 meters per hectare area with average productivity of about 18.3 meters per hectare. Number 15. Cucumber The cucumber is one of the most famous and widely cultivated vegetable plants in the world. Commercial cultivation of cucumbers is a profitable cash crop farming all over the world. Number 16. Green beans Green beans are nutritious vegetables because they contain a high amount of vegetable proteins. Besides carbohydrates and vitamins, the green tender pods are used as vegetables and also also dry seeds. Number 17. Green Peas The pea is an important vegetable internationally. Generally, the crop grows for its green pods. It is highly nutritive and is rich in protein. It is a very useful vegetable to use in soup, canned, frozen, or dehydrated. You can cook it as a vegetable alone or with potatoes. Number 18. Ladyfinger or Okra Bendy or ladyfingers is one of the most popular vegetables in the world. It is cultivated extensively all year round for its immature fruits. Bendy fruits are useful vegetables. You can use the stem of the plant for the extraction of fiber. Number 19. Lettuce Lettuce is one of the most popular salad crops. It is mostly used in the USA. However, it is gaining tremendous popularity in the underdeveloped countries as well. We can consider lettuce as a commercial cash crop farming business. Number 20. Onion The onion is one of the most important commercial vegetable crops grown worldwide. The demand for onion is massive worldwide. It's used both in the raw and mature bulb stage as vegetables and spices. And and with that, we've come to the end of today's video. Do you have any other suggestions as to what to make vegetable farming profitable? Feel free to leave a comment. Thank you for watching. Until we see you again, take care.